And welcome back. We're here with head coach Jay Corsi. And coach, first off, congratulations on picking up your 100th win. Uh, pretty special moment there afterwards in the huddle. The, uh, the guys called you in to break it down. And you really harped on family. Just talk about what, you're, what you were thinking during that game and after you picked up your 100th. Well, you know, I didn't really think much about it. Um, you know, concentrating on winning the game and, you know, continuing our push to hopefully a conference championship and didn't really think about it till all of a sudden with a couple seconds left there's gooey cold water and ice trickling down my back and then another bucket and then another bucket um you know and then it kind of sunk in a little bit but you know uh, my hope is it's always been more about just football it's been about um relationships and helping one another and family and you know commitment and discipline and hard work and you know all those other things that go with it that I think are really really important. I don't know if you went back that night and maybe reminisce a little bit but uh, thinking back could you think of one of the the hundred wins that really sticks out in your mind? No I mean I don't, I don't think there's any in particular to be honest with you um, you know they're all special in their own regard um, you know, from our, our losing season, the one year that was very disappointing, to the you know the, the best years that we've had, it's um, you know you can't you can't really dwell on any one particular one. Um, it's just the memories of all the players that have come through, um, all the players that are here now. Those are the the memories that always stick with me, and and hopefully that's what they remember too. Now, going off of the game, uh, by far the best game that this Rome Prof team has put together this year, and in a very big moment against Mooresville. You really shut them out, 31 uh, 0. Everything was working. You kept Lamar Johnson in the pocket, and then Whit Marshall in the offensive line uh, was just able to run the ball and tempo and control the entire game. Yeah, you know, I, and again, I, you know, I always go back to the beginning of the season. You know, I knew three out of four away, two overnight games. Um, you know, now two teams that are ranked high nationally. Um, you know, I, I knew that early part of the stretch was really going to stress us, and, and I think that's paying off. I think, you know, we've had to buckle down. We've had to go back to basics. We've had to concentrate on the things that have made us successful, and, you know, I, I think overall that's kind of what has helped us. And Saturday was no different. Great team defense, um, a great run game, um, you know, efficient, not a lot of turnovers, not a lot of penalties. And I thought if we could get them in that type of game and really start to press them um, and, and make them have to really, you know, step out of their comfort level, I thought that, that, would, that would work well for us. And I think that's what happened. Now moving on to this Saturday, you travel to Montclair State. They are also 3-0, and uh, tied with you atop the NJAC. Uh, last season, a 7 nothing game, and both of these teams coming in are 1-2 and two in the defense. What type of game are we going to see? Are we going to see a replay from last year? I mean, you know, I don't know. I mean, obviously, they're having a really good season, obviously very successful. They're almost a, a mirror Im image of us. Uh, great team defense, great run game, uh, don't make a lot of mistakes. Um, you know, the, 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 they're the Montclair that they are they have always been. And again, I think, you know, that's a, a mirror image of ourselves. So, um, you know, I, I hope it's not going to be a close game. But, you know, when two teams are evenly matched like we are, you know, there's a good chance that's going to happen. And we just got to keep finding a way to win, which is what we've done the last couple of weeks. Think you'll get to 200? <laughs> that seems so far off. Um, I just want to get to 101, actually. All right, Coach, go get them. Thank you very much.